When you want to be a top dog, strength and power are some of the most important attributes. And some dog breeds possess incredible physical prowess that can rival and even surpass that of wild animals. Just think about the mighty Chihuahua. Those pups could take on a tiger. <laughs> Just kidding. But there are plenty of breeds that might surprise you with their strength. From Argentina's favorite pooch to the OG tough guy dog that's been around since the Roman Empire. Here are the 20 strongest dogs who can easily defeat wild animals. <sighs> Number 20. Doggo Argentino. The Doggo Argentino is a muscular breed of dog that originated in Argentina. I knew you would guess before I said it. Developed in the early 20th century by Dr. Antonio Norris Martinez, this breed was specifically bred for hunting big game, including wild boar and mountain lions. The Doggo Argentino is known for its strength, endurance, and bravery. With a height ranging from 24 to 27 inches at the shoulder and a weight of between 80 to 100 pounds, the Doggo Argentino has a strong physique, kind of like that big muscly Arnold Schwarzenegger dog from Tiny Toons. Its short white coat not only gives it a great appearance, but it also serves to protect it from the harsh elements during hunting pursuits. One of the defining characteristics of the Doggo Argentino is its powerful bite force. This breed has a strong jaw and a bite strength of around 500 to 600 pounds per square inch, which is comparable to that of a lion. This attribute enables the Doggo Argentino to immobilize and overpower its prey quickly. On top of its physical attributes, the Doggo Argentino is known for its loyalty, intelligence, and protective nature. It's a versatile working dog that excels in search and rescue, obedience, and competitive sports. The Doggo Argentino was originally developed to assist in big game hunting, but it's also been used in military and police roles due to its strength, loyalty, and protective instincts. I think this is a good time to pause this video real quick and take the opportunity to join our pack of dog enthusiasts. Like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to keep up with the latest on all these mighty canine stories. We promise it'll be a rewarding journey. Number 19. Rottweiler The Rottweiler is a dog with a rich history. Originating in Germany, it was first bred for herding livestock and pulling carts. And it even descended from the military dogs known as the Molossus that the Roman army used a couple thousand years ago. Today, the Rottweiler is known for its protective instincts, which makes it a great choice as a working dog and a family pet. The Rottweiler is a big breed, typically standing between 22 to 27 inches at the shoulder and weighing in at around 80 to 135 pounds. It has a muscular build, a broad head, and a distinctive black coat with tan markings on the face, chest, and legs. And they used to say black and brown didn't go together. The Rottweiler is an excellent guard dog thanks to its awareness. It's highly trainable and adaptable, which makes it suitable for various roles like police work, search and rescue, and even therapy dog activities. So basically, it can either mess you up or help you get better. The Rottweiler is also known to be a loving and loyal companion to its family. Proper socialization and training are essential for the Rottweiler to ensure that it does develop into a well-behaved and well-rounded pup. Early socialization with people and other animals is particularly important to promote good behavior and reduce any potential aggression. It's also worth noting that the Rottweiler requires regular exercise to keep both its mind and body active. Daily walks, playtime, and mental stimulation are necessary to fulfill its energy needs. This isn't a dog for a couch potato. The Rottweiler's name is derived from the town of Rottweil in Germany, where the breed has its roots. Rottweilers were often found working in the meat trade in Rottweil. They'd pull carts loaded with meat to the market and also guard the butcher's money pouches. That makes sense, because I'm not trying to steal a pouch of something from somebody with one of these next to them. Number 18. Kangol. The Kangol is a mighty breed of dog that originated in Turkey. It's known for its exceptional strength, 
This trait has made it a popular choice as a livestock guardian dog. Kangals weigh around 110 to 145 pounds. They have a thick double coat that provides insulation and protection in tough weather conditions. As a guard dog, the Kangal is known to be devoted to its family and livestock. It's known for its independent nature and strong sense of responsibility. Kangals are instinctively protective, and they've been bred to ward off potential predators like wolves and bears. These dogs are intelligent and trainable, but they do require consistent firm training to ensure they develop into well-behaved and well-adjusted companions. Kangals are not recommended for inexperienced dog owners due to their strong-willed nature. And let's not forget just how big and intimidating this dog is. In terms of exercise, Kangals have moderate activity needs. Daily walks and mental stimulation are important to keep them mentally and physically stimulated. But they're not overly demanding in terms of exercise compared to some other working breeds. The Kangal is also renowned for its bite force. It's been reported to have one of the strongest bites among dog breeds, with a force that can exceed 700 pounds per square inch, which, if you need some context, is really amazing. It's not that far off from the force of a grizzly bear. This impressive bite strength contributes to its effectiveness as a guardian dog, as it can deter potential threats with its powerful jaws. Number 17. Tibetan Mastiff Can you guess where the Tibetan Mastiff originated from? Yeah, that's right, it's Tibet, and you probably knew that. It's known for its noble appearance. Tibetan Mastiffs are among the largest dog breeds, with males typically standing 26 to 28 inches tall at the shoulder and weighing between 90 to 150 pounds. They have a dense double coat that provides insulation in the rugged mountain climate of their mystical homeland. These dogs have a sense of loyalty, a strong one. Tibetan Mastiffs are known for their watchful and alert nature, meaning any wild animals with designs on bothering this dog's family, they'll probably think again. In terms of temperament, Tibetan Mastiffs are generally calm and independent. They're not overly active dogs, and they have moderate exercise needs. They are intelligent dogs, but they can be strong-willed, so positive reinforcement training methods are recommended. If you aren't on top of your game, this dog might end up wanting to train you. And that's not a great situation to be in with such a powerful pooch. Tibetan Mastiffs are also well known for their deep and booming barks. They use their powerful voices to alert their owners of any potential threats or intruders. This makes them excellent watchdogs. Tibetan Mastiffs have a long history, and they're considered one of the oldest dog breeds in existence. They've been used for many centuries by Tibetan nomads as herding and guard dogs. These majestic dogs were highly valued for their ability to take on fierce predators like wolves and snow leopards in the rugged Himalayan terrain. Number 16. Central Asian Shepherd Dog The Central Asian Shepherd Dog, also known as Alabai, has a distinctive bear-like head. These dogs have a long history of working alongside nomadic tribes in Central Asia. In terms of temperament, Alabais are independent and self-assured. They're reserved with strangers, which makes them pretty great guard dogs. Alabais are a breed that requires plenty of exercise and mental stimulation. These dogs love the outdoor life. The Central Asian Shepherd Dog is considered one of the oldest dog breeds in existence. It's been guarding livestock and protecting families for thousands of years in the harsh and challenging environment of Central Asia. Number 15, Cane Corso. Next up, we have the Cane Corso. This is a large and powerful Italian breed. It's another descendant of ancient Roman molasses dogs, similar to the Rottweiler. Cane Corsos have an athletic physique. They have a short coat that can come in various colors like black, gray, fawn, and brindle. Cane Corsos are all about courage. These pups are practically fearless, and they'll lay down their life for their owners. They were originally used for various tasks like guarding property, hunting, and working with livestock. In terms of temperament, Cane Corsos are pretty calm and very confident. Proper socialization is particularly important with other animals and unfamiliar people, as they can be a little overprotective at times. The name Cane Corso is derived from the Latin word cors, which means guardian or protector. This name shows the breed's long history, as 
well, a guardian and a protector. The King Corsos were widely used in Italy for all kinds of jobs. Today, they continue to excel as loyal and devoted companions. Number 14. Bull Mastiff The Bull Mastiff originated in England. They have a solid frame, with males at around 25 to 27 inches tall at the shoulder and weighing between 100 to 130 pounds. These dogs have a calm and gentle nature. Bull Mastiffs are loyal and devoted to their families. They're good with children, and they can be very protective of them. Despite their size, Bull Mastiffs are not overly active. They have moderate exercise needs. Daily walks and playtime are usually sufficient to keep them mentally and physically stimulated. They're generally content to relax indoors with their families. Bull Mastiffs are wary of strangers. They require proper training as puppies to differentiate between real threats and harmless situations. On the other hand, with their intimidating presence, they're effective deterrents against intruders. The Bull Mastiff was developed in the mid-19th century by gamekeepers in England. They were bred to assist gamekeepers in apprehending poachers on large estates. Their role was to track down the intruders and hold them without causing harm until the gamekeeper arrived. That's a pretty tricky task for a dog. I'm impressed. Number 13, St. Bernard. The St. Bernard is a hefty breed, and they originated in the Swiss Alps. They were originally bred by monks at the St. Bernard Hospice to help in search and rescue operations in the treacherous mountain passes. They have a dense and thick double coat that provides insulation in cold weather, with colors ranging from white with red or brown markings. These charismatic dogs are famous for their friendly and gentle nature. In fact, St. Bernards are often referred to as gentle giants. They are excellent family dogs, and they're particularly good with children. We've all seen the Beethoven movies, right? Okay, cool. Due to their large size, St. Bernards require regular exercise to maintain their health and prevent obesity. These dogs have a big appetite. St. Bernards have an amazing sense of smell, and they were once highly valued for their ability to locate and rescue lost travelers in the Alps. They would come equipped with barrels of rum around their necks, although this was mainly a symbolic tradition rather than a practical rescue device. The most famous St. Bernard in history is Barry. During his career in the early 1800s, Barry is credited with saving the lives of 40 people trapped in the snow. His heroic deeds earned him a place in the Natural History Museum of Bern, Switzerland, where his body is preserved. Today, the St. Bernard is still recognized as a symbol of bravery and rescue. Number 12, Bully Kutta. This dog is the Bully Kutta, also known as the Pakistani Mastiff. This is a powerful breed that originated in the Indian subcontinent. It was primarily bred for guarding and fighting purposes. This breed is known for its fearlessness. Bully Kuttas can be very wary of strangers, but with proper training, they can be well-rounded dogs. Due to their size and awesome strength, Bully Kuttas need plenty of exercise and mental stimulation to prevent boredom and destructive behaviors. The Bully Kutta also has a strong prey drive, and it might not get along well with other animals. That includes dogs. These pups will chase down anything that moves. The Bully Kutta is considered one of the most powerful and aggressive dog breeds in the world. It has a reputation for being a formidable guard dog, and it's commonly used in dogfighting activities in certain regions. However, we can't end this segment without mentioning responsible ownership and proper training can help channel their protective instincts in a positive direction, which makes them into loving pups. Number 11, Caucasian Shepherd. Caucasian Shepherds are known for talking like this. Uh, hello there, I am a Caucasian Shepherd. Nice to meet ya. <laughs> Just kidding. But they do have a long history as a breed. They've been used for centuries by shepherds to protect livestock from predators like wolves and bears. They have a strong and fearless nature. Combine that with their mighty size, that makes them top-tier guardians. Despite their imposing size, the Caucasian Shepherd Dog is known for its affection towards its family. 
They form strong bonds with their owners, and they can be gentle and loving companions. The Caucasian Shepherd originated in the Caucasus Mountains of Russia, and they're big dogs, weighing between 99 to 170 pounds. These dogs have a relatively short lifespan of around 10 to 12 years. Like many large breeds, they're prone to certain health issues, which include hip and elbow dysplasia, obesity, and certain genetic disorders. Number 10. Rhodesian Ridgeback The Rhodesian Ridgeback is a large breed that originated in southern Africa, particularly in Zimbabwe, formerly known as Rhodesia, hence the name. They're capable of tracking and holding large game like lions. Yeah, this dog is literally a lion hunter. Rhodesian Ridgebacks have a distinct feature known as the ridge, which is a strip of hair growing in the opposite direction along their back. The ridge is formed by a prominent line of backward growing hair, which creates a distinct appearance. Notable for their athleticism, Rhodesian Ridgebacks excel in many activities like lure coursing, agility, and obedience. They're intelligent and independent thinkers, which can make training a bit of a challenge for inexperienced owners. They're generally good with children, and they can be friendly towards strangers if they're properly introduced. However, their strong prey drive may make them less compatible with small pets. The Rhodesian Ridgeback was initially bed by boar farmers in southern Africa to create a versatile hunting dog that could withstand the harsh African climate. Their sense of smell, speed, and ability to track and hold large game made them very popular. Today, they're still admired for their hunting instincts, and they're popular as both working dogs and beloved family pets. Rhodesian Ridgebacks have made appearances in popular culture, including the movie The Lion King, where the character of Nala is a Ridgeback. Number 9. Bloodhound the Bloodhound is known worldwide for its exceptional sense of smell. They have a long history dating back to ancient times, and they're believed to have originated in France. Bloodhounds are famous for their tracking abilities, and they're often used in search and rescue operations, as well as in law enforcement to track missing people or suspects. They have an incredibly sensitive nose. They can pick up scents that are several days old. They have about 230 million scent receptors, compared to 5 million in humans. Bloodhounds have a very distinct bay or howl, known as the melody in motion, which is a deep mournful sound. This vocalization helps them communicate with their handlers and signal when they've picked up a scent or are on a trail. They have a short and dense coat that comes in various colors, including black, tan, liver and tan, and red. Bloodhounds have a gentle and affectionate nature, which makes them great companions and family pets. They're instantly recognizable with their droopy ears, deep wrinkles, and soulful expression. But in fact, their droopy ears and wrinkled skin help to trap and hold scent particles that are close to their nose, which improves their tracking abilities. The loose skin around their face and neck also helps to amplify the scents that they pick up. The Bloodhound is often referred to as the Sleuth Hound, or Hound of the Law, due to its exceptional tracking ability. Their scent tracking skills are so accurate, their findings are even admissible as evidence in some court cases. Additionally, Bloodhounds have been used to track the scent of missing people or fugitives over long distances, and their success stories are incredible. Famous Bloodhound characters include Sherlock Holmes' trusty companion, the fictional detective Droopy, and McGruff, the crime dog. Only you can help take a bite out of crime. Number 8. Commandor The Commandor is a distinctive breed known for its long, corded coat that resembles dreadlocks. Originating in Hungary, not Jamaica, it was primarily bred to guard sheep. Males are between 27 to 31 inches, while females are slightly smaller, measuring 25 to 29 inches in height. Their iconic coat is great protection against predators and challenging weather conditions. As they mature, their soft, fluffy coat naturally forms cords, which can grow to up to 10 inches or longer. Regular grooming is necessary to maintain the cleanliness and health of the cords, though. Despite their imposing appearance, Commandors are known for their calm and gentle manner. Commandors are independent and self-reliant, often making their own decisions. The Commandor is also considered one of the oldest and purest Hungarian dog breeds, with a history dating back over a thousand years. 
Their amazing coat helps them blend in with the flock, which makes it difficult for predators to distinguish them from the sheep. Number 7. Bull Terrier Originating in England, the Bull Terrier was once bred for dogfighting and later transitioned into a family pet. Their most notable feature is their egg-shaped head. They have small, triangular eyes that are dark and piercing. The breed's ears are naturally erect and closely set together. Bull Terriers have a short and dense coat that's easy to maintain. They come in a variety of colors. Regular brushing and occasional bathing are sufficient to keep their coat looking clean and healthy. Bull Terriers are known for their playful nature. They're energetic and they need a lot of exercise to keep them happy. The Bull Terrier's distinctive appearance and playful personality have made them frequent figures in popular culture. The breed is famously known as the Spuds McKenzie Dog, the mascot for Bud Light Beer in the 1980s. Spuds McKenzie, Bud Light's original party animal. Despite their tough exterior, Bull Terriers are often described as clownish and enjoying entertaining their owners with their humorous antics. Number 6. Belgian Malinois as a herding breed, Belgian Malinois have a natural instinct to protect and be vigilant. They're often reserved and cautious around strangers, but they form deep bonds with family members, displaying loyalty and devotion. Belgian Malinois are often employed as working dogs in various fields, like law enforcement, military, search and rescue, and detection work. Their agility, endurance, and high trainability make them well-suited for these demanding roles. Belgian Malinois are highly intelligent and eager to please, which makes them quick learners and excellent candidates for obedience training. Sit, shti, back, right, left, left, left. Uh. They thrive when given challenging mental stimulation, and they require regular exercise to channel their energy positively. Belgian Malinois have a high energy level. They thrive in active households. They enjoy engaging in activities like running, hiking, and playing interactive games with their owners. Regular exercise and mental stimulation are essential for their overall well-being. The Belgian Malinois is chosen by a lot of law enforcement agencies all around the world for tasks like detection, detection, and apprehension of suspects. They're valued for their keen sense of smell, agility, and ability to handle high-stress situations. Their working abilities have earned them a reputation as one of the top breeds for police and military work. Number 5. German Shepherd German Shepherds are often referred to as GSDs for short, which stands for German Shepherd Dogs. They have an incredible sense of smell, and they're frequently used as search and rescue dogs, sniffing out missing people or locating survivors in disaster situations. But German Shepherds have also been employed in roles beyond working and family pets. They've served as therapy dogs, guide dogs for visually impaired, and even as actors in movies and TV shows. They have a strong and muscular body, with a dense double coat that comes in various colors like black and tan, sable, and solid black. Their alert and intelligent expression is complemented by their erect ears. Despite their reputation for being serious and focused, German Shepherds have a playful and goofy side, often engaging in silly antics that bring joy to their families. The German Shepherd is one of the most widely recognized and utilized breeds in the whole world. It originally was developed in Germany in the late 19th century for herding and protecting sheep. Today, they're not just valued for their working abilities, but also admired for their beauty and their versatility as companions and show dogs. Number 4. Great Pyrenees The Great Pyrenees is a majestic dog that originated in the Pyrenees Mountains of France and Spain. Great Pyrenees dogs are massive, with males reaching 27 to 32 inches and weighing up to 160 pounds. Great Pyrenees are known for their calm and gentle nature. They're often used as livestock guardians, particularly for sheep, due to their natural ability to ward off wild predators. And despite their large size, Great Pyrenees are great with children. Great Pyrenees have a long history of working alongside humans. They've been used for centuries to guard flocks and protect livestock from wolves and other predators. The exact origins of the Great Pyrenees are unclear, but they're believed to have descended from a large flock-guarding dog used by ancient civilizations in the region. 
Throughout history, the Great Pyrenees gained recognition and popularity among European nobility. They were favored by French nobles and were even presented as gifts to royalty in neighboring countries. Kind of presumptuous to gift someone a dog, but I'd be into it. In the 17th century, the Great Pyrenees became known as the Royal Dog of France. They were highly sought after by French aristocrats, and they were often seen accompanying noble families in their grand estates. The breed's popularity continued to grow, and they were eventually introduced to other parts of Europe and North America. In the late 19th century, the first breed standard for the Great Pyrenees was established in France. Number 3. Bull Arab The Bull Arab is a breed of dog that was developed in Australia for hunting purposes. Kind of a misleading name. Get it, boomer. The breed's name, Bull Arab, reflects its Bull Terrier and Arabian Greyhound lineage. The term Bull refers to the Bull Terrier, while the Arab part signifies the Arabian Greyhound influence. The Bull Arab is a relatively young breed that was developed in Australia in the 1970s. It was specifically bred for hunting purposes, particularly wild boar and other game in the rugged Australian outback. The Bull Arab is a crossbreed that typically consists of Bull Terrier, Greyhound, and German Shorthaired Pointer ancestry. These breeds were selected for their specific traits, combining the strength and tenacity of the Bull Terrier with the speed and agility of the Greyhound, and the tracking ability of the German Shorthaired Pointer. Over time, the Bull Arab gained popularity not just as a hunting dog, but also as a loyal and protective family pet. Number 2. Pitbull The Pitbull Also known as the American Pitbull Terrier is a medium-sized breed of dog that originated in the good old US of A. The Pitbull's ancestry can be traced back to various Bulldog and Terrier breeds. Bulldogs were used in bull baiting, a cruel sport where dogs would attack and immobilize bulls. When this practice was banned, these strong and athletic dogs were bred with terriers to create a new breed that retained their tenacity and athleticism. During the early 20th century, the pit bull gained popularity as a family companion due to its loyalty, intelligence, and affectionate nature. They're reliable and trustworthy dogs, particularly around children. Renowned for their athleticism and agility, pit bulls are active and energetic dogs. They require regular exercise to keep them physically and mentally stimulated. They excel in various dog sports, like obedience, agility, and weight pulling. Unfortunately, the breed's reputation has been marred by media sensationalism and misconceptions. Pit bulls have been unfairly portrayed as aggressive and dangerous dogs, when in fact, proper socialization, training, and responsible ownership play a significant role in the dog's behavior. Many pit bulls are friendly, loving, and very loyal family pets. <laughs> The American Pit Bull Terrier is not recognized as a breed by major kennel clubs like the American Kennel Club due to its association with dogfight. However, related breeds like the American Staffordshire Terrier and Staffordshire Bull Terrier are recognized. We think it's important to promote responsible ownership and focus on the true nature of the Pit Bull breed. Let's remember their positive qualities and dispel myths and stereotypes. Each dog should be judged based on their individual temperament and behavior, rather than generalizations about the breed. Here's the short version. They're insanely sweet and loyal, and if you treat them horribly and train them to be aggressive, they're also extremely dangerous. Kinda like most breeds that have a lot of strength. Number 1. Doberman The Doberman was developed by a German tax collector named Carl Frederick Louis Doberman in the late 19th century. He aimed to create a breed that would both serve as a loyal companion and a guard dog. The breed was initially known as Doberman's Pinscher and later became popular as the Doberman Pinscher. <laughs> Herr Doberman aimed to create a breed that possessed both loyalty and protective instincts. He selectively bred various dogs, including the Rottweiler, German Pinscher, Greyhound, and Weimaraner, to develop a dog with a unique set of traits. The result was the Doberman, a breed well known for its elegance, athleticism, and intelligence. Over time, the Doberman's popularity spread beyond its original glad dog purpose and it became a beloved companion. Dobermans have a short coat that's smooth and requires minimal grooming. 
Their coat colors can vary, and they include black, blue, red, fawn, and white, often with rust color markings. Despite their tough and confident exterior, Dobermans can be sensitive and emotional dogs. They're known to be highly attuned to their owner's emotions, and they can provide comfort and support when needed. In fact, Dobermans are often referred to as Velcro dogs because they have a strong desire to be close to their owners. Aww. They form deep bonds with their families, and they thrive on human companionship. Traditionally, Dobermans had their ears cropped and their tails docked for cosmetic reasons. However, this practice is now controversial and thankfully illegal in some countries due to animal welfare concerns. Places like the UK, Germany, Sweden, Canada, and Australia have stepped up to protect these awesome dogs from this unnecessarily painful practice. I'm sad but not super surprised to not see the US on that list. Let's treat our Dobermans with the same love and affection that they give us. We've explored an array of remarkable breeds, each with their own unique traits and physical prowess. Do you have a favorite breed among the ones that we just discussed? Have you ever witnessed the strength of a dog in action? Let us know in the comments below. Also, check out our other cool stuff, showing up on screen right now. See you next time.